Hmm, I have so many sneakers at home. Would I be able to make money out of them? I can open an online sneaker store and be my own boss. Ned has experience in accounting and she mentioned that she's interested in starting a side hustle. I'll call her now. Hey Ned, free to talk? Tom, sure, what's up? Do you remember telling me that you're interested to start a side hustle? Uh-huh. You have something in mind? Yeah. You know how I'm always hunting for the trendiest sneakers and now I have a large collection. Hmm, I was thinking to start Hold on, an hold on. Store. I think it's better to discuss this in person. Meet at our usual cafe? Oh, perfect. I'll see you shortly. Oh, meanwhile, you can start thinking about the things you need for your business. Hmm, okay, Ken, thanks. Bye. Hi. Hey, hey, Ned. You want to start an online sneaker shop, right? I'm interested, but how can I help? Oh yes, I'm not so sure how to go about doing it. I thought you're in accounting, and you mentioned before that you want to start a business. You're the perfect person. Well, do you know anything about assets, liabilities, or equity? Um, what does that got to do with sneakers? So, assets are things like sneakers, which are the goods you want to sell. But, other things can be assets too. Your laptops, live streaming equipment, even the cash that is used to buy your initial inventory. Assets are the resources owned or controlled by a business that are expected to provide future benefits. Hmm, what about liabilities and equity? Liabilities are obligations owed by a business to others. So for instance, if you need more money for the business, you might need to borrow some money from the bank. And that loan is now a liability. Equity refers to the claim by the owner on the net assets of a business. It also usually refers to the amount of capital that you put into the business. Wow, there are so many things I need to know before starting a business. How much money should I borrow or put in as capital? Here is a simple accounting equation to help you answer that question. Let's first figure out how much money you'll need to set up your business. Hmm, looks like you'll need $100,000. Do you have this amount of capital? Oh no, I only have $80,000. Don't worry, you can borrow the remaining $20,000. On my way here, I did a little research about loans and I've texted you the information. Oh, this is just what I need, Ned. Wow, the Singapore Development Bank is offering such a good package for entrepreneurs and startups. Hey, do you want to go to the bank after this with me? Sure thing, partner. Alright. So how about lunch?